Ho! What is going on, everybody? My name is Jacob Forster, and welcome to the Dread X Collection The Hunt. This is a new series of horror games, indie horror games, that have been developed for the Dread X Collection. If you've not seen some of my other gameplays on the Dread X, it's always a collection from multiple different indie devs, usually surrounding a very particular theme. Uh, I think all of the games in this collection are first person shooters, and someone from the team was nice enough to send me over code. This is available on Steam as of today. So let's go ahead and just start this game. I'm gonna check it out, and let's do the story mode. Um, continue the Dread X story and explore the Arc 2 base. Or you can always do free play and just check out the games individually if you prefer. So let's jump into this thing. Artemis, let's see what this is all about. This is Dr. Crane. Mm. You're probably surprised to be hearing from me. I promise I wouldn't be reaching out if it wasn't important. I'll cut to the chase. We need a tracker. Eight of us were able to escape the initial breach. We've set up a new base of operations to track the anomalies and come up with a solution. I think we found a way to fix this whole mess. All we're missing is a tracker of sufficient skill to hunt down the source without alerting it. But we can take care of the rest. Again, I wouldn't be asking if you weren't the best. These collections always have a central storyline that wraps together climate, all of the games. There should be an upcoming window for safe transit, so I've attached coordinates to this message. I hope we see you soon. Sweet! Dread XP. Let's go. With David Szymanski. Probably mispronouncing that, so I apologize. Present Dread X Collection. The Hunt. Yes. Okay, I'm excited for this. I don't know how long each game is, but depending on their actual length, I guess we'll kind of All right, I'll be back in these waters and see how many I can get through. Call and see if you need Perfect. Pickup. Good luck out there. Okay. All right. Cool. Cool. There goes the boat. I guess we're just being dropped off now. Oh. Okay. Let's move around. Can I sprint? I don't even need to. We're already so fast. Okay. It's just a floating orb in the sky. Nice one, Sam. Warm and fuzzy as ever. Maybe we'll have some time to work on your manners between saving the world or something. Oh, <clears throat> got a phone. Field report from tracker Artemis on site at coordinates 76 degrees south by 27 degrees west, attempting to make contact with the team stationed at a base in the vicinity. No visible wildlife or locals, hostile or mm. otherwise. If found, please deliver this log, and if possible, my remains to the West Bay Diesel Nomads. All right. Door. Mm. Body dangling from roof. Uh, locked front door. Bloody <laughs> handprints. Oh, fuck. Mm. Body dangling from roof. Oh, sorry. I didn't roof. mean to repeat it. <laughs> door, okay, cool. Handprints. So let's let's explore fuck. this, like, what did you get yourself outer world, from? outer story first. That way we can start getting into these, Base appears these games. Base one visible body, um, likely deceased. On top of the building, Front of course. Door is locked. Gonna check for alternate means of entry. All right, let's see. Where can we get in here? Frozen door. Frozen shut, won't budge. What about you? <sighs> locked. Maybe I can blast it off? <laughs> get some explosives. Hold right mouse button to raise your rifle. Oh, what? <laughs> okay, not that one, maybe this one? Whoa, whoa, all right, bad idea. <laughs> uh, maybe I can oh, knock no, down work. that body from the roof. <laughs> I must have a key. All right, Artemis, let's go. Let's go get that body off the roof. But first, I thought I saw another door. Yeah, let's check this out. Oh, can I blow this one up? Door's locked. How about we try this? Ready, set, go. Okay, <laughs> nothing quite on that one. All right, so let's, let's blast this body off. Get into the garage further. Get into the facility. All right, we got up here. Kablawi! Oh, not the most graceful solution, but um, you know, hey, <laughs> if it works. <laughs> Picked up exterior door key to view your inventory. Press tab. Nice Exter <laughs> exterior door key. Ooh, recording one October eleventh. Interesting. Aha uh ha! -huh. Cool. Door's been opened. We got an axe, got some tools. Anyone home? <clears throat> it's your tracker. Hope y'all have some fresh... Nothing wrong with me. ...seal meat or something on the grill. <laughs> Look at this graph. Uh, okay. Running low on chips, this. 
Ooh. <laughs> Has anybody seen my mower? <laughs> Look at this graph. All right, okay, let's keep going. Location confirmed as arc, arc two. two. Nice. Interior of base is cold. Likely been abandoned um, at least a week. Gonna try and locate the generator. Generator's this With way. With any luck, I'll at least have a warm place to rest until retrieval. All right, let's keep moving forward. Doors jammed shut yet again. It's a little spooky in here, I'm not gonna lie. What was that? Door is held shut by some sort of power lock. Guess you and your friends were busy, huh, Sam? Ooh. Ooh, I really I really like the the like mystery and intrigue just in this like outer world storyline. A note on the case reports. <clears throat> These case reports contain details on hunts we have undertaken around the world. Each report contains information on the targeted creature, as well as the circumstances leading up to it. It also contains the code necessary, necessary to retrieve that creature's sample from cold storage. Okay. Mess hall recorder. You picked up the mess hall key. Hey there, Artemis. It's Dr. Crane. Look, I know it's been a while, and I don't want to intrude, but we need your help. We've been working on a fix to all of this. A way to kill the cognito virus. Cogn it's not really needle a virus. I can explain it all when you get here. We've collected samples from some of the most aggressive shards, but it's getting dangerous. And we need someone that can get us in close without raising the alarm. That's where you come in. I've attached some coordinates to this message, and mm -hmm. I really hope you decide to join us. <laughs> I'm gonna go again. One more time from the top. Interesting. So this looks like it's the list of all of the games. Because these are the developers with their rows of meat. With their different game names, I believe. So first, go to hallway. Okay, that one opened. That's great. Anything here in the kitchen? Oh, it is very dark. Can't see a thing. Okay, I want to see what will happen if I go ahead and click on these. I'm not sure if they'll start a new game or not, but... Let's see, Philip Hasselbach, uh, Axis Mundi. I can barely read these in this light. I should go get the power on. Okay, makes more sense. Generator it's been time. A while. It's been eight fucking years. Press him to bring up your map. Okay. Cool. Team's operations room. Documents on site indicate some kind of plan to destroy the cognito virus. Still no signs of the team. Located key to the generator. Gonna try and get the base up and running again. Ah, generator this way. Okay, let me pull up the map again. Uh, so we were just in the mess hall, and I think we just went into this area, if I'm not mistaken. Okay. But yeah, restart generator, current objective. Let's go. I think it's gonna be over here. Oh, generator. Ah. Let there be light. <laughs> Perfect. Light it up! Warning. Catastrophic collapse oh. detected in underground testing facility. Please proceed to area to assess damage and disengage alarm. Oh, no. Okay. Uh, wonderful. Time to head down. Hopefully I don't need to fetch, like, a key <clears throat> from the damn roof or something. <laughs> All right. Anything I should grab in here? What the heck is this? Like, logs or something? <gasps> More notes? Nothing wrong with me. Oh, whoa, stop. <laughs> okay, so we gotta go downstairs. I wanna see what's over here, but let's go down here and stop this alarm first. All right, I'm like slightly worried that there's gonna be like terribly scary things down here, but we'll see. Ooh, look at this, this looks cool. Let's go, oh, card reader. Spears to be required some sort of key card. Lab note. Sam, I've taken the lab key with me. This thing gets to the device. That would be very, very bad. Meet me upstairs. I've got a plan. Yeah. Well, I kind of asked for this one. <laughs> <sighs> All right. Back upstairs we go. This is a great way to just kind of introduce the character and, like, everything that's going on here just by making us kind of explore around in this, this facility and this base. I like this. But let's get upstairs. Let's grab this key card. And uh, this is this is a game itself, but ooh, we'll get into the 
the developer games here shortly. Oh, hi. What am I gonna do, rip them off with my bare hands? <laughs> okay, well I gotta get in there somehow, some way. Door to shower, door won't budge. Door's locked. Door's locked. Oh, there's more blood. Okay. Door's locked. This one looks like I might be able to get in. Roof access. Door to roof. Okay. Well, there's the guy over there. Is he gonna have the key card on him? Hopefully? Maybe? Let's take a look. Oh, that's right. I keep forgetting I can pull out my, <laughs> my rifle. Ah ha ha! Note from last survivor. I managed to seal it in. It got me good in the process. As if that wasn't enough, the generator went down and triggered the emergency lockdown. I'm trapped in this frigid nightmare a thousand miles from rescue. I'm gonna try the roof. With any luck, I can hop down, get the generator key from the operations room, and get the heat turned back on. If not, maybe I can signal a boat. I'm taking the key card to the lab with me. If anyone finds this, do not attempt to finish what we started. It knows. Anyone that gets too close to this thing is painting a target on their back. Ooh. Picked up basement, lab, key card. Cool. All right, let's get back down there. Also, is that another body on the roof? <laughs> no, just a splotch. We're cool, we're cool. Nothing else to shoot down. Okay, back inside. I wonder when I'm gonna have to, uh, Ooh, I bet I unlock those keys with my... with the games that we play. What the heck is that? Bound rope. Uh, that rope won't budge. Maybe one of the team had something that could cut it? I should check the bunk room. Check the bunk room. Oh, there's a body in there. Okay. <laughs> Alright, let's go downstairs though, turn off this alarm. We're probably going to be seeing some spooky things in the process, but you know, it's fine. It's totally fine. Nothing to be scared about here. Okay. Keycard slides through the reader with a beep and the sound of a lock disengaging. All right, let's get into the sanitation chamber. All right. Caution, hazardous materials. Let's get that alarm off. Finally. <laughs> I couldn't even hear myself think. Ugh. I don't know if that was the best idea to turn off the alarms. Note about weapon. Okay, the experimental weapon in the next room is nearly functional. The final step is to attune it to the seven samples gathered from trans-dimensional creatures. Samples can be retrieved from cold storage using the tube system outside the lab. Refer to the case reports on the bulletin boards in the mess to find the sample uh, retrieval codes. Sample attunement process. Refer to the case reports on the bulletin boards in the mess hall. Note the sample code for that case report. Enter the code into the sample retrieval computer. The sample will be automatically retrieved from cold storage via pneumatic tube. Retrieve the delivered sample and insert it into the sample analyzer. Once all seven samples have been attuned, the laboratory will be unlocked and the weapon can be accessed. So this little gizmo ah. is gonna save the world. Huh. That's cool. Error. Pneumatic sample oh. transfer system locked. Please check connection located in cold storage vault. Okay. Oh, come on. <laughs> oh. Well, on the bright side, I was planning on checking out the whole place anyway. Good as an excuse as any to see all the glorious sights. Hmm. Okay. Door will remain locked until all seven samples are tuned and the weapon is safe to handle. Okay. Gotcha, gotcha. What about this? Sample analyzer. You got nothing for me there. <laughs> All right, back on through. I found a note that shed some light on what they were working on here. Seems the research team discovered a method of both neutralizing the cognito virus and preventing further spread. Further information regarding the this? cognito virus. The fuck is that? Oh, oh, sorry. I totally. Oh, I totally made that. <laughs> That whole talking sequence just go away. My bad. Okay. I just gotta, I gotta stop triggering events like that. It's fine though. It's totally fine. Hello? Oh, there's definitely something moving around out here. Wait, was that door open before? You unlocked the door from this side. Oh. Ah. 
a trench. Nice. That's uh, almost as good as a tunnel, <laughs> except cold and exposed <laughs> and somehow even creepier. Hmm. Let's check Interior our map. Interior sweep oh, inconclusive. Roughly half a dozen rooms still inaccessible. Haven't located any further researchers, alive or otherwise. Well, there was there one more crush in the rocks. The struggle, and one of the rooms has been sealed off. Continuing search in on-site vault. Ooh, look at this. Okay, this is cool. I'm assuming this is actually where I need to go. Repair the sample retrieval system in cold storage. Yep. And here's deep. Ooh. Deep storage. I don't know if this is cold storage. Yeah. Ooh. Here we go. Oh, is that a person? Uh-oh. Hi. Are you alive? Well, spoke too soon. <laughs> Identified another researcher, not Dr. Crane. Okay. All right. Okay. Oh. I should be able to use that computer in the lab to retrieve samples. Let's just hope there's not some kind of a bomb or plague monster in the tunnel. You know what? <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm not going to jinx it. Yeah, you're definitely going to jinx it. All right. So, this is all completed, fixed. Is there anything up here? Just more rocks. That's fine. That's totally fine. All right, let's get back into the base. So, I need to go to the actual bulletin board and find the codes, then, to punch into the computer. And there's still this very strange... <laughs> just a thing floating up here in the sky which we know nothing about so far. It's constantly rotating too. Oh, blast it. <laughs> Blasty blast. All right. This is though cool. really cool. I love this whole like frozen facility. It's like the thing. The thing, is that what it was called? The movie? All right. Oh, I was like, what did I do? <laughs> Cussing time. Hey, Sky. This one's just for you. Things here are quiet, but shit clearly went down. Hmm. And there's something else I just can't put my finger on. It's like this whole place is trying to push me out somehow. Like one of those inflatable carnival obstacle courses for kids. <laughs> You can get through it if you try, but it's always pushing back. Those things are always the worst. They're super fun, but, but they're so difficult. Gods, if the stars aren't just damn beautiful out here. I mean, if you think those babies sparkle on the plains, then you gotta try a thousand miles from the nearest flashlight. Mm, there's the smashed thing. <laughs> still another 13 days until pickup and I already miss you it'll be a cold night even with the generator on wish I had you here to help me with that I hope you're keeping the dogs close Chloe always gets nervous when I'm gone but you already know that it's one of the big reasons I love you I'll be home soon to tell you all this in person. If not, tell mom I still haven't found her yet. Hmm. Interesting. Exposition, this is great so far. Mm. Oh, there's someone outside. Hmm, you know, it's kind of cozy if you ignore the, uh, Death. Death. First night on site, passed without incident. Several locked doors prevent conclusive sweep. Going to continue facility investigation. Primary goal, discover location of research team. Group's research is possible lead. Perfect. Sweet. So now we can actually get into the games themselves. So we got multiple different report cases. So there should be, I think... There's six or seven games in here. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, seven. Okay, cool. So let's check out the first one, I guess. Axis Monday. Start game or return to board. 
Ooh, okay. Oh, okay, so you probably won't get the code until after you've beaten the game. So let's go ahead and start this, and it's probably gonna load up in a different screen, so hang tight, let's jump into this. All right, and we're here. Let's go ahead and start a new game on Axis Mundi. Select playstyle, Hunter. If you want to focus on the story and be an efficient ghost hunter, Hunted. If you are looking for tense encounters and want to focus on quick thinking and skilled movement. Ooh! I kind of want to do Hunted. That sounds interesting. Vomland, Sweden. I am a ghost hunter. I've been sent to investigate Ooh. a newly constructed Ooh, I like shopping this. mall along Road 45. This is game number one. The construction company, of course, wanted to keep this off the books, requiring me to conduct my investigation at night. Doesn't bother me at all. Unusual work hours is a part of the job. After a long trip here, I'm eager to see what stories this place holds for me. Ooh, gonna be on the ghost hunt today. All right, oh my gosh, okay. Okay, we got a camera. Oh boy. <laughs> okay, that's loud and that takes a long time to charge. Hold aim to aim the camera. Right mouse button. Uh, left trigger. Press interact to capture a ghost when the reticle is red. Left mouse button. Press interact to continue. Oh boy. Oh boy. If things are gonna... When the camera is charging, run. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh my gosh. This is gonna be a nightmare. <laughs> This is cool though. I'm loving this. This game looks great too. Under construction. Okay. Do I, can I interact with any doors? Probably not. All right. Well, time for the ghost hunt out here. Oh, that's definitely a ghost. Hi. Oh, this music is funky. Yeah, I see you there. Are you gonna photograph a spectral memory to enter it? Oh, okay. I guess we'll enter this memory. Ooh. Oh, okay, we're returning back time to 1950, let's go. <laughs> Hello? Is anybody out here? So is this like the start of the construction? Ah, oh, you can crouch with, oh my gosh, hi. Oh, you're so weird looking. Come here. Come here, little ghosty. Oh. Okay. Okay. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Got him. Got him, got him, got him. Oh, this is a really cool mechanic. I really like this. All right, open door. It's locked. Okay. Interesting. Oh, I thought that was an eye in a triangle. But no, it's just a drowning person symbol. <laughs> So, can I not go across then? So how do I get in there? Maybe I go in here? Okay, hi. Oh, oh, I wasn't close enough. Got him. Oh, those flashes are so loud. <laughs> okay, what do we got? We got random stuff. Read. Note to Mr. Banked. The key to the control room is hidden behind the warning sign, as usual. Okay, thanks for the note there, kind sir. All right, let's get that warning sign, and let's get that key. How did I miss it? How did, oh, sorry, Stig, I used the key, but hit under the table for you. <laughs> All right, gonna make me run back and forth, I see. Let's get under here. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Picked up the control room. R <laughs> control room key. Got it. There's probably gonna be ghosts in here. No ghost, all right. Use those controls. Hey. Nice. So I'm, I'm actually kind of curious what the overall... Oh, you can jump. All right, let's get up and over. I'm curious what the overall objective is and why we're going back in time with these memories. Could I... Could I have technically avoided it? Oh, there's another one. Hi. Oh, okay. Got him. Oh, there's another one. Oh my gosh. Oh, there's, oh, there's another one. 
This is, this is freaky. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's more. There's more. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, wow. Wow. All right, this is definitely an intense game. Okay, is there nothing up here? Electrical? Can I just open the door? Is it even locked? Mm, let's go to the back end. Interact. Item required. What do you want from me, game? You got it. Oh, hi. Ha ha! Fuse picked up. And let's toss it into here. Blammo. Kablammo. Opened up. Ooh, do I drop down? I think it's the only way. Use it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, well, I got a flashlight already. Oh, this is turning dark real quick. I don't know if my body's ready. Honestly, when is my body ever ready for these games? <laughs> okay, let's read the note first. To start generator, open the choke. Sometimes you need to jump on it. Two to three times before you pull the handle. Pull the string handle, close the choke. P.S. Fix the circuit in the third penstock chamber stig. It's not that dangerous. <laughs> don't jump on the machinery. Oh, I'm gonna jump on it. Uh, okay, where is the choke? Open choke. Jump on it. One, two, three, four times. Pull the starting handle. And close choke. Hey, 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 Look at that. I'm so good at following directions. It's incredible. Actually, following and not following directions at the same time. Okay, those guys go first. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay, okay. Okay. I don't like those demon faces coming at me. Ooh. Come here, come here, come here. I'm gonna take your picture. Don't, don't run for me. Got him. Oh, there's more. Oh, oh. oh, it got me. Dang it. Okay, let's do it again. Get that guy, get that guy. Gotta watch out for these weird flowy ghosties. Oh, okay, got him. Okay, I'm gonna sprint around, sprint around. Got him. Okay, where's where's the other demon demon faces? Oh, ow, ow, ow. Oh, ow. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> we got this, we got this, we got this. Okay, gotta be careful of those guys. Gotta be careful of those guys. Oh, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Got him! Okay, one more. Candlehead, let's go! Oh, 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 uh oh. Ooh, my health is not doing too well. My health is not doing too well. Okay, one more. Oh, two more. Ooh, much more, much more, much more. Oh no. Okay, okay. Got him. Oh! Oh my gosh, they keep getting me. <laughs> this is terrifying. <laughs> Basically, as soon as you kill one of those, these guys come at you. I'm not a fan of them. Not a fan of them. They're too fast. They just come out of nowhere. Okay, 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 okay. Got him. Should be more clear, ghosties. Dang it. Okay, come on, come on. I'm ready for you. Let's go. Let's dance. Candle ghost. Okay, there's gonna be more. There's gonna be more. Hi, hi, hi. There's another one. Blast him. We got it. Whoo! <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so tense. Okay, what does this say? Read. I tried fix, uh, to fix the wiring like you told me. I fell. It's cold here. Oh, hi. Oh. Ooh, back to 2021. Let's go. Ah, and there's the memory. After my grandmother died. Hi. I was the only one she could communicate with, and we talked a lot, became closer than we ever were when she was alive. Oh. After a while though, she told me That's where cool to find fact. her old camera, this one. Turns out she'd been a ghost hunter as well, and wanted me to continue her legacy. I was instructed how it worked, and it was our last goodbye. She was the first spirit I photographed. Oh. I wonder if I took its picture again if it would just send me back, but 
Uh, what is this? Tree of Wisdom. Read lore. Preface. My name is Dr. Everett Mossberg. I've researched folklore most of my life, and no place has before fascinated me as much as this. Tales from all over the country seem to converge here, with experiences ranging from almost a millennia ago up, up until today. Following are excerpts from my research that I deem relevant for this place. May this reading interest you as much as it did me, but be careful. Some of these beings have a stronger presence here than anywhere else. Con contents, ghast, earbloss, witch hunt, sacrifice, church grim, miling, and conclusion. All right. I can't keep going through it. Interesting. All right. You can always access the lore book from now on. <gasps> ah, tab. Okay, cool. Wait, how do I how do I go through the the books though, the pages? I wonder. Hmm. Okay. All right, it's fine. All right, I see another I see another ghosty up there. Let's check you out, dude. You gonna bring us somewhere cool? I hope so. Oh, we're going way back to 1607. Okay. Interesting. Oh, this is beautiful. Beautiful night. Strolling out and about. Some... Oh, hi. Oh, there's the... There's the wheel. Let's check the note. One person here died for conspiring with the devil. The key is buried above their grave. It's locked. All right, let's figure out who's conspiring with the devil. Oh, hi. Oh, you freak me out. <laughs> okay. Can I just walk through? Is this fine? Are there gonna be ghosts trying to kill me still? Oh, hi, I see. Oh, sneak attack, sneak attack. <laughs> <gasps> oh, I can read them. I was executed for sorcery. I drowned in the river. I was killed fighting in a war. I died in the plague. Did I miss it? <laughs> I must have missed it. I was struck by lightning and I died giving birth. Oh, okay. So we have to, I guess, gather from the information. Sorcery, yeah. Church key picked up. Perfect. Yeah, conspiring with the devil. Sorcery. They go hand in hand. All right, let's open it up. Oh, hi, Candlehead. How many of you... Oh, I've got a traditional... Oh, I missed! Crap. Come on, come at me. Come at me. Oh, you're too close. Oh, what? Okay, okay. There we go. There's more? Are there more? I can't tell. What is this? Turn. Oh. Oh, what the heck? Do I go on top of it? Oh, all right. <laughs> Let's get up over here. Ah, what is this? Pick up. Picked up a rope. Interesting. All right. You've gotten through this puzzle pretty quickly. All right, out of the out of the creepy church. <laughs> Can I use the rope to get across somewhere, maybe? Or what else am I supposed to do with it now? I guess. Like, what is this? Ah, attach item. Oh, okay. Turn it. Look at this. Oh, look at this. Here we go. Time to go down into the catacombs. I see you. You can't scare me. I'm most certain she is a witch. She rarely shows her face around here. Lives on her own, and some people even told me she turns into a black cat to spy on them. We need to do something about this. On another note, there are some strange vines growing down here, but they don't seem to like strong light. Ah, ha ha ha. You gotta go on Harry Potter up in here? <laughs> what is it, the uh, Devil's Snare? Okay. Strong light, obviously, is the camera. So guys, we're worried about the wrong sorcery. Should be worried about these terrible vines rather than. Yeah, I see you. Oh, I see. You. Oh, there's a lot of you. Oh, there's a lot of you. Oh, there's a lot of you. Okay, there's two of you there. All right, recharge, 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 recharge. Okay, we got time. We got time. 
Oh, there's a third one. Oh, or a fourth one. Oh, there's so many more. <laughs> oh, there's two of you. Crap. Crap, 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 crap. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, get out of here. Oh, get out of here. Okay, get you first. So you're terrible. Right, where's the other guy? Where's the other guy? Uh, I see you there. Come on. Make it over. Got him. You hear a door open. Somewhere off in the distance. Whew. Okay. Okay, we're good, we're good. We're solid, we're solid. We're making it through this. Is this the door that opened? More than likely, yes. Uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> just want to make sure there was no other doors that just randomly opened. Ooh, it's dark and spooky down here. Dark and spooky. What does that mean? One, two, two? Or one... <laughs> Oh, what did I do? Oh, it's a looping hallway. You can easily get lost down here. Walk as the arrows say and you'll be fine. I heard rumors about Anna being a witch. She lives past the mill. Be careful around there. Okay, so we gotta go this way first. So we got one. And then we got... Hmm. Maybe I'm doing this wrong. So, one full, and then go two around? Let's see if this works. Did it work? Hmm. I feel like that's a reset noise. Okay, so here, reading it, so now let's go this way. We're at one. One all the way around, and then let's do two all the way around this way. Right? But it's making that noise again, I don't know why. Hmm. Okay, okay. So, other way first. <laughs> let's, let's try to get this, let's try to get this thing. Go this way? this way, and then loop all the way back around. Right? No, wait, <laughs> what am I supposed to do? <clears throat> I'm following the arrows. I don't know what the one means. So let's just do full loop, full loop-de-loop. -loop. That's one. Hmm. Okay, I'm probably overthinking this for some for some reason, some way, somehow. Okay, that's one. One schloopty. <laughs> and then let's go now the other way for another floopty. And then we can go back around once more for a schloopty doop. There we go. Okay, I don't know why that took so long to actually get that right. All right, let's watch out for ghosts, because there's probably gonna be one around here. If I were to guess. Are we climbing out? I think so. Let's get out of here. Parkour, let's go. <laughs> ah, ha ha ha. Okay, cool. We're over here. Hi. Jeez, this scare me every time. All right, just one hopefully for right here. <gasps> okay, wow. <laughs> yeah, these things freak me out. Ghosty, gosh. Any more? Any more of you guys? You wanna go, you wanna tussle? Hey Jarl, you should check the view from the roof. Connect the gears and use the platform to go up. Okay. Connect the gears. Move gears, okay. Those are connected. Let's move this one. Nice. Oh, wait a second. <gasps> what? Why isn't that working? Can I? Hmm. 
That's strange. Why does that one want to work? Uh... It gets stuck! That's odd. Okay, so let's start from the beginning. They're all off. Let's put this one on. Let's put this one on. And then let's put this one on. And that should work! What the heck? Oh, maybe I'm supposed to do it backwards. So connected. Connected, and then connected. What? Okay, I'm doing something wrong here, and I don't know what it is. <laughs> These ones don't want to move, though. For some, for some odd reason. Uh... <laughs> Connect the gears and use the platform to go up. Oh, okay, okay. Oh my gosh. I didn't know you had to move multiples of them. Okay, so let's move that one. And then let's move that one. Now we can move that one. There we go. Hey, we've made it to the top. Look at us go. Look at this beautiful view. Ghosts? Any ghosts? Y'all got some ghosties up here? Hmm. What should I be looking for? Huh. There's a beautiful view, so what should I be searching around for? Picture of the moon? Moon time! <laughs> I walk on this? I can't even walk on it. Strangely enough. Oh. I walk onto this thing. But why would I want to? Huh. Ah, oh, crap. Go away. Oh, go away. Oh, what? Oh! <sighs> Didn't. Oh, wait, hold on! <laughs> in time all right guys all right candle guys oh my gosh I realized there was only that close all right, come on. oh I didn't even take the picture all right we're just running around oh, 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 oh. Go, 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 Okay, let's get candle face. Okay, got him, got him. There's more, there's still more. Hi. Oh my gosh, there's so many. This is what I get for using... Oh, we're putting it on hunted. Oh, there's four of them? Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. <laughs> okay, we got it, we got it, we got it. We got a note. We got a noose. Read. I didn't warn I didn't want to harm anyone. I'm just different. Why couldn't they leave me alone? Oh. Back to 2021, let's go. Sweet. Hunting is probably the wrong word if you think about it. Oh. A very specific flash and film type is needed to capture a ghost. But it isn't the spirit itself that's captured. It captures the negative emotions that keeps them here with us. It isn't really about defeating some malevolent force. It's about empathizing. Hmm. Looks like we have an entrance right here now. Oh yeah, it's like a weird underground area. So there's nowhere else I can go over here, right? Doesn't look like it. Alright. Let's go down further. In the deep down. Ooh. All right. Uh, another gear puzzle, huh? Let's figure it out. Oh no, it's just parkour. <laughs> All right. And ah, we're in the under construction area. Oh, shiny ghost there. Not time for coffee yet. <laughs> Opening soon. 
Man, this music's so groovy. I love this. Alright, shiny ghost. You're in another... Oh, we're going way back for this one. 1350. Alright. What do we have here? Standalone cabin. <clears throat> Hi. This is a much more sad area. The Magistrate Magnus. The plague has gotten worse, you know it. We've lost a third of our population, people we know and love. Maybe we should give the old ways a chance. If you get lost, remember, ant hills are always placed south of the tree they are close. Oh, okay. So that is south. Interesting, so where are we supposed to be heading? We've got a cemetery, we've got a cabin. Let's go to the cabin first. Maybe there's some extra notes here for us. There is. A little church. Do you open? No. Alright, what do you got for us? I've heard stories about summoning the church grim, about pressing the slabs at the stone circle in a certain order. I don't know much about that entity, but I know we shouldn't mess with it. Mention it this Sunday. The church grim. Okay, we can't interact with that. Let's get to the cemetery. Ooh, we got symbols. So we gotta press, press this in a very specific order then, to summon the church grim. Etched in wood, the right symbol will be found in three separate slabs in the forest. Press the symbols found on the slabs in the east, west, and south. Okay. Uh, so three separate slabs in the forest. So EWS is where I need to go. So east, west, and south. Where is my first ant hill though? I need to find out where to go. East, west, south. Okay. So, never eat soggy waffles. Let's go east first. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, this way. So let's find a slab. Hopefully we don't run into too many ghosts out here. Ah, the mark of death, the death mask. Okay. Okay, so that was east. What was it west and south? Yeah, so let's immediately go back this way. So death mask is one. Let's hop on over here. Oh wait, oh no, it's this way. Ah, I'm stuck in the trees. <laughs> oh, wait. What? Oh, this just brought us back over... Oh, okay. I was like, wait, where, where am I? <laughs> okay, south. So I need to go that way, but... um, I guess back from where these were, I need to go that way. So this way. Yeah, this looks... Looks more right. Okay. Rainstorm. Hmm. I like this. This is great. This is such a good, good way to present a horror game in this way. And I'm assuming this is south. We've got the, the skull horn. And this is definitely to the south. All right. So we've got. Death mask. Uh, rain cloud. And, oh, I'm not ready for this. I don't think my body's ready. And... Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, what? <laughs> okay. Okay, okay. Not a fan. Not a fan of you. Ooh. Oh, I don't like you. You are creepy. You are very creepy. Oh, what the? What the heck? Oh no. Oh, okay, I was not expecting other creatures to be out here. 
Is this just starting from scratch, or what's up? Do I have to reactivate it? Probably. <laughs> this is creepy. All right, let's do it again. Creepy mask. Water clouds. This guy. Come at me. Let's go, I'm ready for you. Oh, I see you. Got him. Oh, ouchie. Okay, you already got me. Okay, where's it? Dang it, I missed. Okay, does that thing just permanently come at me? I think so. It's like a weird ghost bug. Oh, you're right there. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna take a picture of you. <laughs> oh! Got him. Okay. Oh, this is such a cool, like, boss. Ghost boss fight. Did he die? I hear strange voices from the west. Uh-oh. Oh, there he is. Hi. Um. They were too scared of the plague. They thought it was better to give the reaper what it wanted. I was given it as an offer. Oh. Oh, look at you. Oh, you're so cool looking. <laughs> Say cheese. <laughs> okay. Oh, poor person. Back to 2021, let's go. Time for coffee? Ideally, our death is quick and painless, but history is full of the opposite. It's the bad intentions and tragic outcomes that really haunts a place. There are a lot of stories hiding in the dark corners of the earth. Hmm. I've had the opportunity to witness countless, and I know I've only scratched the surface. If there's one thing I've learned, it's that we all want someone to take a moment and listen to us, even if we're dead. Well, I think it's time for a cup of good hot black coffee. Time for coffee! Those never sleep, do they? It is time for a coffee. Perfect! I should grab a cup of coffee. Yes, please! <laughs> a game by Philip Hasselbach. Hasselbach. Oh, that was wonderful! Oh, that was so cool! I love that! Part of the Dread X collection. Oh, man. This is... These collections are always... Oh! Corpse Pile. I don't want to take away from the actual dev, but Corpse Pile makes some really awesome games. Um, in the, like, indie horror genre. Axis Mundi. Ah, oh, that was great! Yeah, these, these collections are always, always, always such a worthwhile thing to do. So what do we do now? I'm assuming we can just exit then. Somehow, some way. Look at all these other sections that we don't really have the ability to go towards, but this might be something that they're because I, I know a lot of these games are made like in a very specific time frame. So I wonder if this is something that was or that's like still in development, and that's what the developer would like to do with it. I think it would be great to see this expanded upon. I mean, it's it, it's amazing for what it is already, but uh, I'd love to see anything more that they would end up doing with this. But let's go ahead and exit to the main menu. And back in Return to Board, A3, C3. Cats, I have seen some rough places on the fringe, but just what were you thinking, Sam? You're a doctor, not some kind of commando. <laughs> It appears oh. the group had been conducting expeditions to collect samples for some kind of weapon. According to these files, there should be seven samples, each associated with a different expedition. Mm -hmm. Well, Sky did always tell me I should read more. Ah, oh, sweet. So if I go back into it, so A3, C3 is what I need to enter into the computer. Oh no! Places on the fringe, but <laughs> just I didn't realize it would. Oh, I can just press space, perfect. A3, C3. Let's go put that in the computer. I wanna see what happens when I put the first code in. A3, C3, right? A3, C3. 
Let's do it. I wonder if I actually have to remember or if it will just do automatically for me. Oh, okay. Thank you for the sterilization. Always a good time. Here we go. Ah, A3, C3. Ah, what do we get? Sample one. Ah, picked up sample one, perfect. And then that's when we put it in here. Okay, right in my face. <laughs> and that did something, I think. Uh, guess I'll just have to get the rest. Sweet. Cool. First sample retrieved and inserted into the device. No obvious changes. Continuing research and sample collection. Perfect. One down. Seven. Uh, six to go. Yeah, look at that. Okay, cool. Pew, pew, pew. <laughs> Before we get our super weapon in here. All right, is it going to make me decompress? Or is it just going to open? It just opens. That works totally fine. Awesome. Man, this is such a cool, this is such a cool collection. I, I'm definitely going to keep playing through this. Uh, I think I'm going to try to hit all of the, hopefully hit all of the games in this. Um, because I'm actually like super invested in the the storyline that's going on in the like overworld game, in addition to wanting to experience all the rest of these awesome games and uh, these incredible developers. So six more to go. We've done pretty much all the introduction to this. Uh, I'm just gonna keep keep calling it the overworld story. We did a lot of introduction for that. We played our first game. I think for the next few, I want to be able to hit at least two games per episode. Um, so that we've get, we've got one, two, and three, three more to go. I keep hearing thumping like in the roof. Uh, so that way we have three more episodes to go. I think this would be an awesome thing to keep running through, but uh, I'd love, love, love to hear what you all thought about this introduction to the Dread X collection, The Hunt, and all the games that we're experiencing here. So if you're excited for more, or you just enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the like button and leave a comment down below. I'd love to hear from all of you and just what your overall initial reactions are to this. Uh, what you thought of the first game that we checked out. And of course, if you want to make sure you're checking out even more of these and keeping track with this storyline, if you're not already subscribed, consider doing so. Hit that bell notification that we know exactly when I'm uploading videos. And of course, as always, you all are awesome. You all are amazing. And I cannot wait to see you all in the next video. Later.